Hi everyone, in this video we're going to be installing an unofficial build of the Pac-Man ROM on the Galaxy S4 Mini LTE. Now for those of you who are wondering what this ROM represents, it's basically a combination of three popular AOSP ROMs and those are Paranoid Android, AOKP and Sanjay Mod. In this ROM you'll also find some parts from Slim Bean, Carbon and so on. And also according to, to Grimly, who is one of the developers on this ROM, claims that uh, this ROM can be used for daily use, so that's good to know. So in this video I'm going to show you how to install this ROM on your Galaxy S4 Mini LT and we're going to have a quick look at some of the features. So start off by downloading the ROM zip file and the GF zip file into your SD card. Then power off your phone. And once it completely shuts off, hold the home button, the power and the volume up at the same time to boot into recovery mode. And you should be in Coco Mode Recovery. Now the first thing which you need to do is you need to select Wipe Data, Factory Reset. Select that, then select yes to confirm. Just be patient, this will take a few seconds. Next, you need to head into install zip. Then choose it from external SD card, which is the last option. And now locate the ROM zip file which you have downloaded. Here it is. Pack. Choose that and choose yes to confirm. Once again be patient, wait for a few seconds and it will be done. And once it says install from SD card complete, you then again head into choose it from external SD card and this time locate the gapps JB zip file, which is the Google Apps, because by default you do not have any Google Apps, just the uh, Google Play Store, the Gmail and so on. So this will install really fast, pretty much for 10 seconds. And once you're done with that, we're gonna head back and we're gonna reboot the phone. Okay, there we go, head back and choose reboot system now. So I'm just gonna skip the boot animation and the whole waiting and I'll be back once the phone is on the home screen. And there we go guys. This is the Pac-Man ROM and it should be running as you can see. So let's test one of the main functions and that is the camera. These are one of the features that must be working on this ROM. So I'm gonna take a photo. Yep, it is working. Let's switch to a video. Let's play the video. I'm gonna take a screenshot while playing a video. That works as well. Um, it seems to store the videos as well. Okay, so can't really notice any problems with the camera here other than the quality which I cannot really check at the moment, you could do that for yourself. Anyways, the camera is definitely working on this ROM. Next is we're gonna test the mobile data, I'm gonna see how this functions. So if I manage to load up the Google Play page, I definitely have mobile data working. There we go. So as you can see, this has some additional options here on the uh, toggle button screen. If we head into settings as well, you can also see how you have some more things here. These are the basic system uh, settings, but they are also tapped. So if we go into Pac-Man, you can see you have loads of custom options here. Now this is a highly customizable ROM. As I mentioned earlier, it is a combination of three custom ROMs and you have tons of features available here. Now of course we cannot test all of this in this video, we're gonna have to do that for yourself. I basically showed you how to install this and a quick look at what you get after you install this. So that is all everyone, I hope you enjoyed this video, if you did please hit the like button, if you haven't subscribed already please do so. And once again everyone, thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.